Thank you for choosing Gush. This is a how-to tutorial on how to mix and apply Gush paint. There are two varieties of air purifying Gush paint. The first here is Care Fresh, and that is in an eggshell washable finish. We also have the original matte finish, which is Care air purifying paint. Whether you choose Care Fresh or Care, the instructions and application for applying and mixing is the same. Today, we are going with Care Fresh. Gush air purifying paint is much thicker consistency than your typical paint, so it's highly recommended that you dilute it with no more than 10% of clean water. You can use tap water, however, it's highly recommended to use the cleanest. Here, we have distilled water. Let me show you how to properly open Gush. There is a tab here. You just pull that and you peel it all the way around. What is very unique and user friendly about the Gush paint buckets is that there are two little finger marks to easily open the paint so that it's best for your safety. I'm going to show you the simplest way to add the water to your bucket. You simply look at what's in there and do not remove and fill your water. All you saw me do was fill the water up to the very tip of the bucket. Now that your gush paint bucket is filled with paint and then water to the very tippy top, I would suggest you not mixing in this bucket. So we are going to mix in a typical paint bucket. Try using this one. I recommend using this type of bucket because it's reusable and easy to clean. It also has a built-in grate. You can also use a five gallon bucket with a metal grate. You can find either of these at any hardware store. Now we're going to pour the water and the paint into the bucket. The water goes in easily. However, you need to either use a commercial scooper or look in your kitchen for a spatula to remove the paint and dump it into the bucket. Now you can always mix with a typical wooden mixer or you can go with a paddle mixer and a drill. Now we're going to mix just like cake batter. Be sure to mix your paint extremely well so that it's consistent and there's no more water floating on the top. I am going to apply the paint with a roller today and this has a 3 8 inch nap. You can also use a paintbrush. Make sure you wet your roller very well and use the grate on the side to spread it evenly onto your roller. Okay, great. Now we're ready to apply. And that's how you apply your gush paint. Thank you for choosing Gush, and thank you for breathing better and living better.